There's a lot of different armor styles that you can get. It's pretty cool. The best climb I've seen has to be Unity. I haven't played that one so long. I do want to go back sometime. Why do they keep showing this picture at the same time? What does it make any sense? Oh, maybe that's a different one. It's annoying what looking at pictures when they can just show you on a map. <laughs> I want to try to get this this thing cuz it's pretty cool. All right, so the gloves, I see that. This one. And we also get to do some traveling while we're at it, you know? Ah, I see. I think it's right here. Out. Wow. Okay. It's actually right here. So, in order to get there, the fastest way would probably go from here to there. So I'm gonna fast travel here and do that. Luckily, it's only like three pieces. All uh, right, now four. So, as long as it's, uh, accessible and we're able to get in without like too many issues then it should be all good and then we'll have uh armor that we can run like the remainder of the mission with or the game with which i am down to do oh, it won't equip now Let the sail out. All right, go to my marker. Strike up a tune. And while we do that, I'm going to run to the bathroom real quick. So I will be right back. We can continue later. Look, a military outpost. Run up the sail! Alright, I'm back.
it's a good way to uh, travel the world as well because now we'll have more places to uh, to uh, fast travel to when we need to further on Pick up from There, no other mask. Set the mast up. <laughs> Just around this corner should pretty much get us there. Jeez, there's a lot of, uh, dude, looking at some of these areas is so cool. Like the map is so big that like different uh, locations and stuff really, I don't know. It's just so neat seeing like how it changes up and all that. All the different raids that you can do as well. Really neat. Alright, looks like we're about to stop right here. Reef sail! And let's grab the next piece. What's wrong with you? I don't know what they did between the last one and this, but uh the heck the guy's like stuck looking at the sky. Uh I don't know what they changed and but they they made a, a good amount of improvements since since then gonna be one of these good old puzzles that you get to solve <laughs> was water physics though Is that our way out? I think that's the way out. <laughs> Not just yet. Ah, there it is.
Now we see. see what we're supposed to do. to my video Let's see okay you need to find the key i see that then you run down here oh really that a coincidence that's pretty cool thought about that. to grab onto this. Oh. <laughs> ah! Come on. You can do it, man. even difficult it's just the fact that he's making it difficult you can do this man you can do it Monivore, got this. We are trained for this. Uh, maybe not. 
Wait, maybe we're supposed to blow something up on the other side. Found their answer. I see why it was so <laughs> travel out of here yeah we should be able to cool all right let's check out where the next one's at it looks like it's just about right here Almost. Right there. Best way to get there looks like to go through here. Let's fast travel to that. And we can't check the piece that we just got. That's all right, though. Yeah, I missed my uh, shave head uh, of war. I think we're going to have to go back to it. I don't know. I got used to it. I like the aesthetic of it. I thought it was pretty cool. Sail out. Sail out. Let's have a song. Oof. It's a good distance for this next one. Traveling's chill though. It's only this next piece, and then there's Hush now. one more or two more, and that's it. Yeah, no, three more. So we just got the mask, which is this one, which is pretty cool in itself. Um, while we're traveling. I'm going to give it a shot. I'm going to try to go eating something. So I will be right back and then we'll continue. But I'm going to leave it like this. And hopefully we don't die. We'll see. Got, a, got us close. <clears throat> ah! Have a little bit of a ways to go. Oops. Yeah. Yeah. And we. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Um, you start out with a horse and everything, but yeah, you can uh, up upgrade it to a uh, oh, Bruins College. That's cool. You can upgrade to a uh, wolf.
good amount of uh, cool stuff you can do, I would say. <laughs> I also have an ability that I can, uh, there's a, eventually when you upgrade the uh, settlement that you stay at, um, a kid will move in and you can upgrade the, that looks so cool. Just looking at the mountains in the background. That's so neat. I love this game. Like literally. It's so, so good. Um, but you can upgrade. Uh, what was I saying? Now I totally forget what I was saying. Wolf. Oh, oh, there's a kid that moves into your neighborhood and basically, um, or your settlement. And if you follow him, he takes you to a uh, pretty cool area. Yeah. That ends up, uh, once you complete the mission, you get a wolf that you can call in at any time. Oh, that scared me for a second. Go! Not this one, but the one that I can call in. Yes. Um, it's like it's used as like a distraction ability, sort of. So like when you call it in, uh, it goes straight towards uh, wh whoever you call it in on. Which is pretty neat. All right, I'm gonna check this here to see. second one looks fairly easy to get to you're there so. I like how they make these like not too too complex either it's very nice i remember doing like back in the day the assassin's creed 2 stuff um having to get like 12 pieces or whatever just to unlock the like really cool armor that was rough okay now let me see what we do here now something is not right it just covers his mouth up getting the altar after it was too difficult yeah literally God, I keep having to go back because i don't realize that there's more of this
Okay. I think I see. Ah. Oh my god. What the? Okay, I think we got this. Smells like a trap. That's pretty cool. And I like how it lights up like that too. Okay, let's read this. Anything else uh, inside here? These are so cool. I love these little, like, actual Assassin's Creed stuff. It's so refreshing, finally. All right, two pieces left. to get there I think the closest one would be this you know I probably could just take a one of the small boats instead I think they they might be a tiny bit faster actually instead of taking my giant uh, raid boat but We'll see. If there is one at the dock, then I'll try it. Two more pieces left. Two more. Is there co-op? Uh, right now, no, there isn't. The closest thing to co-op would be that, uh, the thing with the using other people's, um, you know, uh, the Yelms Vikings, <laughs> which isn't co-op at all. But it's still kind of cool to see, you know, other people's characters in the game, I think. But it's definitely 
doesn't compare to playing full on with another person. They're off. Let the sail out. Sing, my ravens. Sail down. <laughs> Sail out! If that boat is empty, can I potentially take Up it from the him? sail? <laughs> Sir. I'm only borrowing it. I think it technically is faster. I know, poor dude. <laughs> Oops. Just a morning strolling around on the boat. going up north is uh definitely more of the older area as you can see or got strong arms to boat move like that fast yeah right I love all the fast travel points that we're unlocking while doing this. Just look at it. Just embrace it. Look how beautiful. So cool. I promise I didn't steal this boat. My problem with, um, my problem with, like, I would say, Odyssey and Origins is both of them were very very like the i felt like the environments a lot of the times like look the same and granted you do get some areas that do look similar to each other but like just look at where we're at right now compared to the forest that we were at earlier or like now we're heading towards the mountains like there's so much more variety of we can go to forests you can go to areas that are like not like a drought but i don't know they're more like civilian areas <laughs> um it's just they, there's so much variety yeah they, i mean they all still looked really good and they still looked really cool but like I felt like while you're traveling through Egypt and then also um, with Odyssey, like some of the areas a lot of times ended up looking very similar to the to the each other. But in this one, like you travel to a different side of the map and it's like an entire different experience, you know?
All right, we're almost there. I can see the icon in the distance. I like Assassin's Creed map the most uh, because each major, major city, it has its own personality to it. Same. Assassin's Creed worlds are, are underrated. Yeah, I would, I would say so. Um, I really liked like, even in like Assassin's Creed 3, that was still one of my personal favorites. Uh, I know a lot of people didn't like it, but I really liked Connor. I really liked uh, all the environments you went to, all of that. Like still, that game has a special place for me. But um, yeah, I, I would definitely agree. I want to go back. I want to like go back and do all the, um, not the older ones, but the, the newer Assassin's Creed's. So like, um, starting from not Black Flag, cause I played it maybe, I don't know, maybe starting from Black Flag, but like go Black Flag, Unity, um, Syndicate, and kind of stop there because I don't want to really do an entire new another playthrough of uh, the other two <laughs> Odyssey and Origins but I really want to go back and play those Syndicate was boring I liked I mean like I like Syndicate I don't know if it was like the best but then again like I like all of them like I yeah. literally like every single Assassin's Creed game in one way or another. Syndicate is one of the ones that I really want to go back to as well. Like Unity, I really want to go back to because of how much they probably changed. And I really don't remember much of that game like at all. Um, so I really want to go back to that for that reason. But also uh, Syndicate, I really want to go back to. Whoa, this place looks so sick. Yeah. As well, mainly because of uh, like after playing yeah. Watch Dogs Legion, there's like literally some things that are identical. They're both London. It's pretty neat. Okay, so let's see here. So from my understanding, it's right about here. And let me check again. the combat was rushed i can see that all right it looks like this one is one of the longer ones so might take a second for this all right first let me get inside I need your eyes, my friend. Jorvik. is that <laughs> okay let me see they swam through here come through there climb through this
All right, it kind of it doesn't really show exactly how to get to it, but apparently there's like other stuff you can find in here. Yes. like a, a training area or something. <laughs> Wow, the door just opens for this one. That's nice. Ooh. I see now. <laughs> We're locked. Break that open just in case. Okay, so there's two things. So I see where he's at to get Ah Wow <laughs> It's literally like in plain sight Up there. Oh my god, dude. Really? Take that. Thank you. Have you ever played Metro Exodus? Yeah, I actually did a playthrough not too long ago. Um, of it. About, uh... Within the last year, I did a playthrough of, um, all... Metro games. Nice, I need one of those too. Sweet. Multi cheese. All right, you got one more to go. that again I 
see the body of water that it's nearby, but I can't find that. Oh. Right there. All right, let's do it. That's the final one right there. Final piece. And there's a nice, a fast travel point right there. Ah, perfect. Love it, love it, love it. This better be worth it. <laughs> Just hopefully it is. And it's gonna be like perfect timing once we get this last one as well. Cause uh, I'm gonna have to get ready to head out shortly. So, shortly after. Sail! Catch the wind! Sail! Sing us a song. We can continue later. Want to see an Assassin's Creed game with RTX? Uh, I, I have an RTX graphics card, but there isn't any RTX settings. Um... Take the mask down. So, yeah. <laughs> Oddly enough. Like, if I go into graphics here, I'm, I'm mainly on very high right now. Um, but, as you can see, I mean, if anything, you might take screen space reflections. But even that's turned off. Most that mostly everything is on high, very high. Water is even on medium right now. Raise the mark. Yeah. Yeah. Uh okay, so if I want to get over there, I go straight for now. This wind would fill the sail. Oh, I came by here earlier because I remember seeing that that area. Hold on, good scout. What's got into you? The one thing is I played both yeah! control and uh, <laughs> Metro with RTX, without RTX, because I didn't have the graphics card back then. <laughs> so I missed out on that, which is unfortunate, but it is what it is. We're almost there. Final one. Well, that looks pretty cool. Reminds me of the uh, the saunas in Ghost of Tsushima. I I feel like like ah! this game literally does remind me of Ghost of Tsushima in some areas, in some ways, even though it's technically its own thing. Ghost of Tsushima is still my game of the year personally, but if that hadn't came out, if that didn't come out this year, then uh, this game I think would probably be, as of right now, my game of the year. We'll still have to see once like Cyberpunk and all that's out as well, but still. Um, 
I really like it a lot still. I have so much fun with it. All right, let's see here. Oh, just I get in the air when Cyber comes out. If it comes out, yeah, literally. <laughs> So let's see you, old friend. Aha, there it is. If they see me, this will get messy. Okay, let me watch where he goes then first. Well, I see the way in. I wonder if you would have to bring another one down here. See. How did he get in there? Always about climbing somewhere else, man. <laughs> Back up this way? No. There's the skeleton. I was looking for the skeleton for a second there. Keeps freaking out. And up. Oh, well, up. Oh, I'm up. Hmm. 
Ah. Is that also? That's smart. They put the thing in the way. <laughs> okay, so now you just climb to the other side. I see. <laughs> they put something in the way so that way you couldn't just walk right into that room. That's funny. Let's equip it. Let's just see what it looks like. I mean, I still need to upgrade it and everything, but it's a good start. Boom. There she is. Uh, let's show gear. Boom. There she is. Kind of hard to see in this area. We'll unhide this as well. The hidden gear. The hidden ones mask and gear and everything. Everything. It's pretty sick. I actually kind of like it without that too. I think that looks pretty sick itself. It's like fitting. without the giant robe. The robe is cool too, though. Like all black stuff. Let's throw the hood up. I'm gonna see what that looks like. Like that looks pretty sick too. Can you ride a pony? <laughs> uh, I think so. Yeah, you can though. Um. You can honestly take either a horse or a wolf or whatever. I just felt like the wolf was more fitting, honestly. So that's why I went with the wolf. But uh, let me go back to our area here. And I think I'm going to change up my stuff again. my uh appearance i miss my my ivor <laughs> i don't know if i like the the robe or not though to be honest it's like i kind of like it with like this so you can see his tattoos and everything like he still has the armor and all that but at the same time i don't know i don't know man i haven't decided yet you know Know what I mean? But <laughs> he's still all wet from the gear. Like, I feel like this I makes him look very bulky. Hey. But at the same time, I mean, it's not like that bad. Yeah, let's speak with this guy. I like the dude's six pack, six pack tattoo. What right? have you got for me today? I think I'm even gonna go back to this thing. I really like this tattoo. And this. This is my Avor. That all for now. May I see your story? And then. Do I switch? Part of me wants to switch back to this so that way it's matching as well. I think I'm going to because I still like All that. Alright, if you're done. I will see you. See you later, A4. Here we go. Yeah, the, it's just like the... This, 
the robe is so bulky it does look very cool but it's very bulky that's the one thing i don't like about some of the stuff but like this i mean granted it looks like he's more lightweight and everything but still um i feel like it looks pretty cool and if we go like this boom i heard the cave physics in this game were weird uh yeah they kind of could be like you mean the the disguise portion of the game is kind of weird to be honest um in that in that aspect but uh we got two points let me actually add those in real quick and then it will be good all right chat this is where i'm going to chill for today uh actually perfect timing seven o'clock exactly on the nose 